Welcome back to Film On. Today I'm going to explain the movie called The Untamed from 2016. Spoilers ahead, watch out and take care. And I hope you enjoy it. At the beginning of the movie, we saw a meteor, and it was coming towards Earth. After that, we saw a girl named Veronica. She was in a room, and a creature was having sex with her with his tentacles. But then we heard the voice of a woman. She was calling Veronica to come outside. Actually, this was the home of a couple. When the woman went to the room, the woman was not there, and there was blood on the bed. The creature had injured Veronica with its tentacles. Therefore, Veronica was bleeding. She went to the hospital with her bike, where a nurse named Fabian did her treatment. Fabian asked her which animal bit her. Veronica didn't say anything and left. After that, we saw her sister. Her name was Ale. She was not so happy with her marriage and her husband. Her husband's name was Angel, and he was unable to satisfy her. They had two kids. At night, Angel went to a club. Fabian was also there. They met each other, and then they had sex. And we found out that Angel was in a relationship with his wife's brother, and his wife had no idea about it. The next morning, Veronica went to the hospital for a checkup. Fabian did her dressing. Veronica asked Fabian if he likes sex. Fabian told her that everyone likes sex. After hearing this, Veronica became friends of Fabian. On the other hand, the old couple was so worried about Veronica. They were scientists, and they were researching that creature. And the creature lives in their house. At night, Veronica came there to meet them, and then she told them about Fabian. They planned to make Fabian have sex with the creature. Veronica wanted to have sex with the creature once again, but the couple told her not to go there, because last time the creature had hurt her. The next day, when Angel was in the field, he texted Fabian that he wanted to meet him. On the other hand, Fabian was spending time with Veronica, and they became very good friends. Veronica told Fabian that she's in a relationship with someone who always satisfies her, but she has no idea if it's a male or female. Actually, Veronica was talking about the creature. But Fabian found it so strange, he thought that Veronica was joking with him and blushed. The next day, Angel asked his wife about her brother. His wife told her that he must be busy with his work. On the other side, Veronica asked Fabian to go to the old couple's house. Fabian went to their house and met the creature, and then they had sex with the creature. The creature satisfied him very well. At night, Veronica, Fabian, Angel, and Ale went to a club. Fabian was so happy, but Angel was so mad at him because he was not replying to his texts. When Fabian was in the washroom, Angel also went there and tried to kiss him, but Fabian stopped him and left. Angel was so mad, and when he came out of the washroom, he saw that his wife was dancing with a stud. After seeing this, he became angrier, and he started a fight. While going home, Angel beat his wife for her unusual behavior. The next day, Angel went to the hospital to meet Fabian, and Fabian broke up with him. Angel was so shocked and angry at the same time. At night, Angel was so drunk when he came home. His wife managed him. Angel was crying a lot, and he told his wife not to leave him. The next day, the police found Fabian near a pond, and he was passed out. Fabian was found near the old couple's house. Fabian had no clothes on his body, and it seemed like he was badly beaten up, because there were so many scars on his body. Ale cried a lot after seeing her brother like this. The doctor told her that someone had tortured him very badly. Therefore, he's now in a coma, and the doctor has no idea about when he will come back from the coma. Then Angel came there and calmed her down. Now Angel had turned into a family man, but deep down, he was scared that one day his wife might find out about his relationship with her brother. The next day, when Ale went outside the hospital, Veronica came to meet her. She asked her about her brother. She told her that his health hasn't changed at all. He is still in a coma. After that, Ale told Veronica that she needs to go to her brother's house. Therefore, Veronica took her there by bike. Ale found her brother's phone, and she read all the messages that Angel sent him. Angel texted him that if he doesn't go to him, then he will kill him. After seeing this, Ale realized that they were in a relationship, and she started to think that maybe Angel tried to kill him because he was mad at Fabian because of their breakup. 
She wanted to talk to Angel about this, but she was scared, and that's why she couldn't talk to him about this. The next day, Ale went to the hospital, and the doctor told her that Fabian was a good nurse. Ale felt good after hearing this. She filed a case against Angel about her brother. When Angel was doing his job, the police went there and arrested him. A worker of the hospital said that he has seen Angel with Fabian many times, and last time Angel was shouting at him. Ale also showed all the text messages that Angel sent to Fabian. With all the evidence, it was clear to the police that Angel had done this to Fabian. That's why they put him in jail. Ale was parenting her kids alone. One night, Veronica came to her house and she became very good friends with Ale. The next day, Veronica took Ale to the old couple's house. The couple told her that when Veronica was a kid, she found this place accidentally. But since then, she's been coming here every day. She also told her that the creature was immortal, and she shouldn't be scared of him. After that, we saw a scene from the forest, and all the animals were having sex at the same time. The old lady had put sleeping medicine inside Ale's drink. Therefore, Ale passed out, and then they took her to the creature's room. When Ale woke up, she was so shocked by the look of the creature. The creature came closer to her, and then had sex with her as well. After coming home, Ale hugged Veronica, because now she was totally satisfied. She asked Veronica if her brother also went to the creature to have sex. Veronica said yes. She also asked her if the creature had done this to her brother. Then Veronica lied to her and said that the creature never hurts anyone. Veronica went to the old couple, and they told her to stay away from the creature. Now Veronica wants to go far away from this place. She told Ale that the creature gets bored by one person, and that's why he always seeks for new people to have sex with. At first, the creature gives pleasure to his partner, but when he gets bored, he hurts his partner. After hearing this, Ale realized that the creature had done this to her brother, because he was bored. Veronica accepted that she had lied to her, and Ale forgave her. After that, Veronica went too far from this place. One day, when Ale went to pick up her kids, then the teacher told her that their grandmother had picked them up from school. After hearing this, she went to Angel's mom, and they had a fight with each other. But at last, Ale came back with her kids. She went to the creature every day to have sex. One day, Ale went to the hospital and took off his oxygen pipe. Therefore, he died. She did this because her brother had cheated on her with her husband. Angel's parents were so rich, they took Angel out of jail with their money. Angel was so depressed and disappointed in himself. He wanted to commit suicide, but his dad came there and stopped him. On the other hand, Veronica was on a trip, and she met a man from the trip. They had sex, but the man was unable to satisfy her like the creature. Ale was staying in a rented room. Angel came to her house, and Ale got scared after seeing him. Angel was so mad at her because he thinks that Ale had sex with someone else when he was in jail. Ale told him to leave, but Angel started to beat her. He pulled out his gun to kill her, but by mistake, he pulled the trigger and the bullet hit his leg. He asked Ale to help him. Ale took him to the truck and took him to the old couple's house. When they opened the door, they found Veronica's dead body. This means Veronica came to that creature to have sex, but the creature killed her. Ale gave away Angel to the creature to kill him, and the creature killed Angel very badly. After that, Ale and the scientists buried their dead bodies in a big hole in the ground, and there were so many dead bodies on the ground. Ale told them that these bodies are getting rotten day by day. This means so many people had come here to have sex with the creature, and the creature killed them. This was the story of this movie, where a meteor fell down on Earth, and an alien came out of it, the scientist couple had called the alien to visit Earth. There was a big hole in the ground where the meteor had landed, and we saw that all the animals who came to the hole were having sex. This means the alien had the power to make anyone or any animal have sex. The couple hid the alien in their cabin, and one day Veronica found this place, and she began to come here to satisfy herself. The alien had a habit that he would only have sex with a human for some days, and then he would kill them. Veronica was addicted to the alien, and that's why she wanted to have sex with it all the time. One day the alien got bored and hurt her. But still, Veronica went to the creature, and the alien killed her. 
And the same thing happened with Fabian as well. The alien got bored, but still, Fabian went to the alien again and again. That's why the alien injured him so badly that he went into a coma. But Ale thought that her husband had done this to her brother, and she sent him to jail. When Angel came out of jail, he tried to kill Ale, but he failed. Then Ale took him to the alien, and the alien killed him. Viewers, Veronica had the job to give new humans to the alien to have sex. So many people died because of her. And that's why we saw so many dead bodies in the hole. To watch more explanations of these kinds of movies, click on the videos on your screen. And don't forget to let me know how you feel about today's video in the comments down below. And at last, I will say, stay safe, stay well, thanks.